was always a reader and a writer. My favorite book, which my mother just gave me at Christmas, uh, was a dictionary that she gave me when I was in first grade. Reading was just a very important, it was a game and it was a, a way of, um, I don't know, moving through the world to read and write. And, and I always wanted to, to be a writer. I stopped reading and writing for the whole time I was in Austin. I just, you know, I was kind of uh, beating myself up for having gotten a master's in creative writing instead of business. <laughs> At some point in an airport, I think it was probably in San Jose Airport, I picked up a paperback Barbara King Solver novel, and it was the first literary fiction I had read in three and a half years, and it was literally nectar to a parched soul. And within six weeks, I had resigned my job. People don't give you money if you don't have money, you know, they, and, which is the, the difficult part of starting a nonprofit. At that point, uh, the office was in my house, in my living room, and I had these uh, writers that I was paying tiny, embarrassingly tiny stipends to. Glimmer of Hope was the transformational, um, impactful grant that made the organization just really catapult forward. We've got um, eight employees and we have um, a pool of 20 to 30 writers that uh, we can pull from to do our various programs. We're close to a thousand a year that we're serving right now. to a lunchroom worker at Doby Middle School um, a few years ago who had a copy of our anthology in her purse because her son had been in our program at Johnston High School and um, she carried that with her because that was her son's book because her son is a writer. I'm, I'm so amazed, you know, by what these kids write and do. I love reading the um, submissions when they come in when we're putting the anthology together. And then when I meet the students at the readings, I find myself just like when I'm meeting, you know, adult authors. I just, I love your work, you know, <laughs> because I do. Their, their work is really amazing and, and they're so proud of what they've done. 